Nah, brother, the game is gone. The game we used to love is gone. What the fuck do you mean stopping the game for 34 minutes because of a, a thunderstorm? Nah, 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 nah. These European motherfuckers need to cut this bullshit. If this was South America, the game will be stopped until someone is dead. They don't give fuck. They literally play in Peru with no fucking oxygen. And do you think a thunderstorm will stop them? Even in this game, there you have the fucking Vikings themselves playing. And the motherfucker in their team who came back from the dead. You think thunder will scare him? The game is gone. We understand that this might be dangerous, but not to stop the fucking game for 34 minutes. Stop it for like 4 minutes until things get calm, then continue the game. Okay, let's come back to our Real Madrid hate watch. The hate watch must continue. We can't stop it like these motherfuckers because of a thunderstorm. No, brother. We keep cooking. We keep cooking. We're going very strong in here. We had Cruz and Rudiger. By the way, don't start uh, about Gundogan. Okay, this is a Real Madrid players hate watch. I said this many, many fucking times. I don't care about Barca players. I can't hate watch them. Yes, Gundogan had a shit game. Okay, shut the fuck up. Let me focus on Real Madrid players. Let's start first by Cruz. You could have told me that Cruz wasn't playing and I would have believed you. It wasn't a bad game or a good game from Cruz. No, it was just a boring game from Cruz. I didn't see him do something special. Didn't take that much shots. Didn't create that many chances. Even for his passes. His passes, they were all for the defender next to him or the midfielder next to him. That's it. Some passes weren't that good. I didn't like this game from Cruz. I can't lie. Last game, he was average. This game, I I didn't even see him. Don't hate me. I'm just telling the truth. If you tell me that's all, oh, he had a great game. Tell me one moment that you saw him do something great. Okay, let's go to stats and we can speak about it more in details. 8.1 rating. I don't give a fuck about the rating seriously in here in Fotomob. This sucking Real Madrid player's dick. This was obvious from the start of the hate watch. We understand this very well. He had 96% passing accuracy. You see what I told you? Not that many passes. And Cruz missing four passes. That's a lot. Again, that's a lot. That's a lot. I don't give a fuck what you say. He had one shot blocked. He had one unsuccessful dribble. Passes in the final third, you see 13. That's shit. Like, basically, he didn't do nothing to the attack. 50% accurate crosses. Long balls. Yeah, I remember the one that he missed. Yeah, I remember it. He almost had an assist if Schlotterberg didn't foul the goalkeeper or Gundogan or Kimish. I don't know what the fuck was that. Not that good. Not that bad at the same time. It's just boring, like I said. Rudiger, my brother, redeemed himself. I liked Rudiger today. I can't lie. He covered a lot of spaces he even played the right back sometimes i see you see him bad positioning from a defender but i absolutely respect that man i can't lie you see i'm being fair in here he was shit the past three games but today he proved that he is a world-class defender absolutely love and respect to rudiger he had some dumb passes tackles yes i know but when things got serious he showed up I like that from him. He got the ball from that shot from Eriksen in the first half when he controlled the ball. Have you seen that ball control from Eriksen? Oh my god, brother. That's that's football. That's pure football. This is Joga Bonito. An amazing game from Rudiger. Rudiger, fair enough. 